Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I'm Heba Abdul Ghaffar. The representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs and President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, affirmed that the achievement the athletics team made in the 21st Arab Athletics Championship held in Egypt is in accordance with the support of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa to support the youth movement in the kingdom and His Majesty's directives on the importance of honorably representing Bahrain reign in all international events. His Highness Sheikh Nasser noted that the achievement provides an incentive to continue to achieve the aspirations of His Majesty the King, His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa. He asserted that the result affirms that Bahrain Athletics Association follows the strategy that is aimed at winning gold medals in international participations. Hail the efforts of the association's president and members. His Highness stated that Bahraini athletics, as a result of the direct support and follow up of the association's president, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, affirms its constant implementation of the plan, whose priority is increasing the status of Bahrain in international events. He noted that His Highness Sheikh Khalid has set the foundations and the plan that will lead the champions to the winner's podium. His Highness Sheikh Nasser added that the sports movement in the kingdom continued its course towards increasing the gains the champions of Bahrain have achieved in various championships, affirming that the achievement of the athletics team is a source of pride. The Council of Representatives held its weekly session today, presided over by its speaker, Fawziya bint Abdullah Zainal. The Council speaker expressed thanks and appreciation to His Majesty the King for his support to the Council, his keenness to achieve the aspirations of citizens, and his directives to not burden citizens with more commitments and to continue to find other alternatives that help meet challenges. She also expressed pride in the royal praise of the Council, its youthful spirit, and positive enthusiasm for the country. Interest. The session began with the review of His Royal Highness the Prime Minister's letter regarding a draft law to approve the agreement between Bahrain and Brazil on air services. The Council approved to refer the draft law to the Public Utility and Environment Committee and the Legislative and Legal Affairs Committee. The meeting discussed a number of proposals and draft laws and reviewed a number of questions from council members. It also approved to issue a statement on prohibiting Israeli speakers from entering the Kingdom of Bahrain. The Speaker of the Representatives Council, Fawzia bint Abdullah Zainal, expressed thanks and appreciation to His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa for supporting the Representatives Council and his keenness on achieving the aspirations of the country and its people, and for his directives to not burden citizens with further commitments. She expressed pride in His Majesty's commendation of the Representatives Council role and the youthful spirit and positive enthusiasm towards achieving the country's interests and development, highlighting His Majesty's appreciation for the Council's role in defending the country and its citizens. Zainal affirmed that the effective national movement the Council is witnessing is a result of the royal support and a translation of the royal vision and directives to parliamentary work. She added that His Majesty's highlighting the importance of allowing the youth to share the responsibility is the Parliament's priority and the Representatives Council is keen on implementing the royal directives with the cooperation of the Executive Authority. Zainal noted that the Representatives Council supports all projects and cooperation agreements between Bahrain and Saudi Arabia on economic, energy and commercial and investment affairs, adding that the Council will not hesitate to provide parliamentary support for those vital projects. She hailed the outstanding cooperation with the government, led by His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, with the support of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier. The Foreign Affairs Minister Sheikh Khalid bin Ahmad bin Muhammad Al Khalifa met with the Pakistani President Dr. Alif Alvi during his current official visit to Pakistan, where he conveyed the greetings of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa to the President. The Minister also conveyed the leadership's wishes of good health and happiness to the President and the friendly people of Pakistan. 
Pakistan. The Pakistani president asked the Foreign Affairs Minister to convey to His Majesty the King his sincere greetings, best wishes and appreciation for His Majesty's efforts in reinforcing bilateral relations for the benefit of the two countries. Sheikh Khalid affirmed that the strong relations between Bahrain and Pakistan are being accorded high care by the two countries to attain broader cooperation and meet the aspirations and interests of both sides. He also valued the role played by Pakistan to reinforce regional security and peace and support initiatives to activate collective action to surmount crises and challenges. The Minister of Foreign Affairs, Sheikh Khalid bin Ahmed bin Muhammad Al Khalifa, conveyed the greetings of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, to the Prime Minister of Pakistan, Imran Khan. This came during the meeting between the Minister and the Pakistani Prime Minister today in Islamabad as part of the Ministry's official visit to Pakistan. The Minister expressed the Kingdom's pride in the close relations with Pakistan, which are distinguished with mutual respect and common interests. He pointed out that these relations are as a result of the progress and development witnessed in the continuous communication between the officials of the two countries. He also affirmed the keenness of the kingdom to further bolster joint cooperation and coordination to achieve common aspirations of the brotherly countries towards further progress and prosperity. The Pakistani Prime Minister expressed pride in the visit of the Minister of Foreign Affairs, commending the development of bilateral relations. He also affirmed the importance of continuing efforts to enhance mutual cooperation at all levels for the benefit of the two countries and peoples, wishing Bahrain further progress and prosperity. The Minister of Foreign Affairs, Sheikh Khalid bin Ahmed bin Muhammad Al Khalifa, met in Islamabad yesterday with the Pakistani Minister of Foreign Affairs, Shah Mahmoud Qureshi. The minister praised the deep rooted relations between Bahrain and Pakistan, which are constantly developing at all levels in light of the consultation and coordination approach of the two countries and their keenness on enhancing cooperation on all levels and achieving further progress and prosperity for their people. He expressed appreciation for Pakistan's stances which reflect the strength of relations between the two countries and their strategic importance to both sides in addition to the relentless efforts in serving Islamic causes and enhancing joint work in addressing regional and international challenges namely all forms of terrorism for his part Shah Mahmoud Qureshi expressed pleasure in the Minister of Foreign Affairs visit to Pakistan and reflected his pride in the relations between the two countries he also expressed gratitude for the kingdom's continued brotherly stances in supporting Pakistan in various international forums, stressing Pakistan's aspirations in developing all means and investing all opportunities to bolster relations of the common interests of the two countries and their peoples. The minister and his Pakistani counterpart signed a protocol amending the Convention of the Avoidance of Double Taxation and the Prevention of Fiscal Evasion with respect to taxes on income and capital. The Minister of Foreign Affairs, Sheikh Khalid bin Ahmed bin Muhammad Al Khalifa, met today with the Chief of the Army Staff of the Pakistani Army, General Qamar Javed Bajwa, in the framework of the Minister's official visit to Pakistan. The Minister praised the deep-rooted historic relations between Bahrain and Pakistan, affirming his keenness to bolster bilateral cooperation at all levels. He also noted that the continued coordination and consultation on various issues enhances the interests of the two countries and supports their efforts efforts to establish regional peace and security, especially in light of the current changes and challenges. For his part, General Qamar Javed Bajwa expressed Pakistan's pride in its distinguished relations with Bahrain, which are constantly developing at all levels, which reflects their importance to the two countries. He also wished Bahrain further progress and prosperity. Regional and international issues of common concern were discussed during the meeting. 
The Minister of Foreign Affairs, Sheikh Khalid bin Ahmad bin Muhammad Al Khalifa, affirmed the deep rooted relations between Bahrain and Pakistan on all levels and in all fields. He also expressed satisfaction in the deep and ongoing development of joint cooperation for the common interests of the two friendly countries and peoples. He conveyed the greetings of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier Prince Salman. Muhammad Al Khalifa and their wishes of further progress and prosperity to Pakistan. They discussed the relations between the two countries and means of enhancing cooperation at economic, political, and security levels. He also added that the two sides signed the protocol amending the Convention of the Avoidance of Double Taxation and the Prevention of Fiscal Evasion with respect to taxes on income and capital between Bahrain and Pakistan. Sheikh Khalid also praised the efforts exerted by Pakistan in establishing peace and security. He also called upon Pakistan and India to adopt dialogue as a means of discussing issues between them and as an approach to resolving any disputes, as well as pursuing diplomatic and peaceful methods as an approach of maintaining regional and international security and stability. The minister pointed out that coordination and communication between Bahrain and Pakistan on all levels, on regional and international international issues and in different international forums will achieve their common interests and support their efforts in establishing peace and security. An agreement was signed between Tamkeen and the Ministry of Works, Municipalities Affairs and Urban Planning's Agriculture and Marine Resources Directorate. In the presence of the Minister of Works, Municipalities Affairs and Urban Planning, Assam bin Abdullah Khalaf, the agreement aims to train 15 Bahrainis on the techniques of fish farming operations, which comes as part of the government's keenness to encourage and support investment in the field of fish farming for its importance in providing food security in addition to the the government's interest in supporting Bahraini competences.